Nobody we have here, but Oh god, I need to get my headset plugged in, it's all tangled. Is this Ori? No, it's Far Cry it's, it's Far Cry Primal 2. Oh no. Ah headset! Why are you tangled? Bastard! That's, uh, that's the Lion King world. This turned up. I'm going to Tycoon. Nah, it's got dinosaurs and it's it's the Jurassic World of some description. Have you played to Tycoon? By the way, have you got announced that this is Xbox E3 2018 briefing? Can you turn the subtitles off on uh, Twitch? Halo 6? Halo 6? Wow. Halo 6? Oh good. Halo 6! Halo 6! He's back, Sparrow. You know he's gonna be in Smash. Smash! You know what? I don't think it is. Well, yeah. No! Halo Infinite. Oh, in Halo Infinite War. Master Chief dies in Infinity War. Cause that's what it takes to be in Are they soft rebooting it? Oh, you can get off. Oh, it's very good. It's even the light shield. Are you? Oh, that does look nicer, though. The front of them. No, there's been gameplay, though. Please welcome the head of Xbox, Phil Spencer. Alright, I'll find you a from Master Chef. Jesus Christ, Phil, yeah. what's happened to you? Oh, what's going on? He's walking against bigger every, like, every three. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go to the next one. Alright, let's go to the next one. Alright, let's go to the next one. Who's this fucking football team wearing all those white shorts? With Halo yes. Infinite, we will I join know. Master Chief on his Infinite. greatest adventure yet to save humanity. We're now at a moment of exceptional creativity in gaming. We can't wait to show you what Creativity Unleashed looks like for you. So to all the gamers around the world, across time zones and languages, to every single person watching us on TV and on Mixer, and to our largest ever live audience, the thousands of you with us right here in the Microsoft Theater, welcome to E3 2018. I'd like to personally thank everyone who's joining us from FanFest. A hundred percent of the Yay. proceeds from your FanFest tickets are going to Gamers Outreach. Thanks to you, kids in children's hospitals get to game with their friends in their favorite worlds, to great cause. Midnight, have you not seen my That's bingo? what I appreciate I mean, most that's, about that's gaming. One of them on there. Gaming brings us together. Yeah. Oh. Gaming ready. connects us. It inspires our truest cooperation. It creates some of our fondest Someone's memories of competition and our deepest conversations about the <laughs> stories <laughs> within games. Most of all, gaming fosters real community. It reaches across age, ability, race, gender, and geography. Just now, this is why I've always believed, and that. will always believe, hey, Tyler, that gaming is a great genders. unifier. <laughs> and what unifies oh, us is our shared love of is this art even, form. Uh, is he even in the chat? Legendary characters yeah, who yeah. captivate us. Not just for 10 hours, but for 10, 20, 30 years. Bold Look, stories that inspire the hero good. within us. Iconic worlds that are so richly imagined, we feel excitement in the air and danger on the seas. I don't. As gamers, yeah, no, no, we are awesome at a momentous there, time. Where creative vision hey, Tyler, and cutting edge you technology back, said together the, these games are delivering the art form we genders. love. So, yeah, I said all for months, genders. our teams and I have traveled the world meeting developers from Japan to Poland, 
Let's from the UK to the Ukraine, <laughs> from big studios to single no, developers. No, we would, we would creators who bought, seize the just full power and potential of Xbox One to this express their off. most daring vision for games. Today, we curated a bold showcase of their best work and yes. ours. Yeah, no shit. That's why, you're, that's why we're here, dude. 18 titles with exclusivity. Exclusive! And 15 Exclusive world shot. premieres. 50 fucking games. Jesus Christ. Some will be first timers on this stage, and others will be first timers on any stage. All are imagined by the industry's greatest talents. You have to make All demonstrate what true artisans can create. Mind-blowing art, immersive sound effects, breathtaking worlds. Uh, so oh, let's oh, probably, he, jump in. Oh, he said artisans. Exclusive. That's your exclusive dot wav. Exclusive. <laughs> exclusive. What's this, what's this first Ori. exclusive? Ori. Hey! I knew this would be the first thing. Out there's your world premiere. Dot wow. Skate four. Skate four. Not skate four. Assassin's Creed. Nah, it's not. Oh, like... uh, uh, Odyssey. Nah, this isn't Greek. This is Shenmue. Oh, nah, Shenmue's been premiered though. Oh, isn't? Is this is that Capcom Samurai game. So you're awake. Hyrule. No, it's not Hyrule Warriors. Oh, 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 she... More Looks like death is not your fate. Warriors. Just yet. From Soft. Oh, it's, no, it's that, like, oh, Dark Souls oh, thing oh. that showed up last year. Oh. Some time has passed oh, like, since I found oh, you. Oh, it's Oh, The master it. still lives. It's the, the Dark Souls of Samurai games. Line. That already exists. The limb you've lost will give way to something more. You'll learn to appreciate its worth. Oh wait, Neo. Neo was never made by From Software. It's gonna be hard to top Neo's combat. I thought that's like the best Souls. I don't know, like, there's just something about this. Your Neo death looks better. won't come easily.
don't know, there's just something about this that doesn't catch me like Dark Souls or Bloodborne, like... This doesn't catch me like Nick Dion's beam is happening. Not so much that, it's obviously made by FromSoft and it's playing like a, a very fast paced Souls game, which is great, it's got like fast paced nature of Bloodborne, but there's just something that isn't really like as catching about killing regular humans with a bit of, with a bit of a samurai undead feel than there is about killing the Elvish Horrors from beyond from the Bethesda Veil of Time game Studios. Space. Todd Howard. Oh shit, Fallout 76! Fuck! That! Skyrim! How's everybody doing? Oh, it is multiplayer. Look at the background. You can see there's a load uh, of machines all with the same again. thing on. You know, actually, the Bethesda event is a few oh, hours right after this across snake. the street. And uh, Phil said to me, I'm having a few friends over. Why don't you uh, stop by? And look, I know Just Phil is really, really charming. Um, but damn, he's minutes. got a lot of friends. <laughs> and the good news is, you're our friends too. We've had an incredible 16-year history with Xbox going all the way back to the original with Morrowind. Yay. Now backwards compatible. And that goes all the way to bringing mods to consoles with Fallout 4. And now we are bringing the Fallout universe oh to Xbox Game Pass with Fallout 4 launching today. Pretty sure you're a bit late now. And hey, since we're here, we thought we'd give all of you an exclusive world premiere first look at Fallout 76. Yes, Fallout 76 is a prequel to all the other games, and it is our biggest one yet. It is four times the size I knew it. It, of Fallout 4. Ooh. Set in the hills the of West Virginia, of you are one of the first to emerge into an untamed and very different wasteland. I don't know if I like this bigger open world, but we'll, we'll see. Don't you have an issue with big boats in Virginia? Oh wait, no, it doesn't have the OG power on it, does it? Uh, probably. In the so law, Vault 76 was the first vault to ever be opened after the bombs fell. Yeah. That's the Fallout one! Oh, oh. I've, I've played all the Fallouts. And... Oh, Fallout. Here, so far we can see the Master in the newer versions of these games. Hey, is this like flashbacks in the first game? You know what this means though, if it's like a prequel? I hope the, the smart death scrolls are actually back. Began, we gather together to honor the completion of Vault 76. This sprawling underground shelter like, may have been engineered by Vault mass? Tech, but it was built why by you. Why is everyone putting F in the chat? So that if the bombs do come, everyone our way of life Will endure. This is when this is oh, where Fallout begins. Yeah, this is West Virginia. Oh, that looks nice. That looks great. It looks huge. Life is all there. Older you than the trees. Younger than the mountains. Blowing like the breeze. Country roads. The football team town. For when the fighting has stopped and the fallout has settled, oh God, you that must tell. rebuild. Not just walls, not just buildings, but hearts and minds, and ultimately, America itself. Vol 
Colt 76, our future begins. That's good. That's Spyro. That's Spyro. That's the poster. Fault to 4K HD HDR. Did I hear what, Swoop? World yeah, premiere. Hear that, Spyro? You already gained take place? Spirit of my silence, I can no, no, hear no, you. No, I'm gonna have to tell I'm afraid to be near you. Spot, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I oh, don't know it's where, to where to begin. I don't know where to begin. Alright, go on, say again, Swoop. To begin. America for a fucking fallout. Oh, life is strange. It's just me. Oh, life is strange. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. All right, I'm just, I'm just gonna not, not even... I'm not even gonna say anything about Tumblr is strange. Life is... Life is a special 12-year-old. I don't need a lecture for my son. No, it's life is Tumblr. Download for free. They can't tell stories like you can, can they? No way. Start the launch. Carl, you know this is actually a really popular game. No, it's not. It's, it's just Tumblr. Oh yeah, shit. Speaking of which, you should be writing this shit down. Yeah. What have we had? Ori 2. Um, this time, you won't get away from me. Life is a special uh, 12 year old. No, we had that Samurai Dark Souls. Freddy Fazbear! Samurai. Uh, for, uh, the Samurai I'm Dark Souls is called Thirty Me too. Ah, oh, the mom's dead. So like, uh, I hope so. I know so. Life is Tumblr. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Tumblr 3. <laughs> Are you serious? Awesome Adventures of Captain Spirit. Captain Spirit. Download for free from June 26th. Exclusive. I check it out. It's free. All exclusive. Commander Jack on deck. Welcome to Crackdown. Crackdown. The only game built like me. Big, beautiful, like a skyscraper. Oh snap! It's Terry Crews. at your face. If you want to play on my level, I stream fit. Follow my lead. Somebody give me my jam. No Wait, is Harry Crews a playable character now? Yes. You gotta build up that raw power. Grab more. Grow more. Why can't they get freaking Harry Crews to do this? Because he's gonna be cursed. Harry Crews is now cracked down, cannon. Bullseye! 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 Crack down with Saints Row before Saints Row. And then I roll out. I'll be playing this on PC definitely. I think Xbox will have a heart attack. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Okay, now this comes down in 20 minutes. This comes down in 20 minutes. These bad guys just that quick. They got mad. Mad science. God, I hope he doesn't talk for like the entire game because he's already going, getting fucking great after a minute of speaking. February 2019! <laughs> We'll Xbox take One X. Near Automata! Yeah! They were right, Near Automata's been released. Includes all previous DLC. Become as God's edition. Everyone loved that game, didn't they? Yeah, it was really good. Oh. Is that Metro is that like a game of Yeah. yeah. And the Wait, sky is behind me, science. And the ground oh, burned to ash. Five. And the sea is boiling. And people turned. Have you never played a Metro game? Oh, 
Basically, it's bootleg so let's Fallout at this point. The no, it isn't. It's Russian ball. Fallout. No, it's not Fallout. It's Fallout. It's not Fallout. As you can see, I'm Midnight. Sorry, As you can see, Midnight, the bombs have Most dropped and we're going to a, into a war-torn, ruined land. Language might be enemies. By conviction or no, it's not about bombs we're dropping. We're no, the bombs have already dropped and now we're living in the ruins of humanity, as seen by all all these um, images of the ruins yeah, of the humanity. Don't drop it natural, it's natural. It's post apocalyptic. Yeah, like Fallout, which is also post apocalyptic. Oh, look, it's first person shooter, just like Fallout. Oh, I'm sorry, it's a book. So is it, so is it basically Fallout? Yeah. There's the pipe pistol. It looks ball out it here. Okay, when did Metro 2033 come out? It doesn't matter when it originally came out, this new one, Exodus, just looks like Fallout. It's a more linear Fallout. It's not linear, it's open world. Look at him walking down the open world. We'll cross it no matter well, what I'm talking about the previous Metros. They're more like horror games. Yeah, they're more horror games. I'm gonna clearly play. not if you're shooting giant guns at things. I know, but it focuses more on the atmosphere. I'm gonna still play it because I played like Metro 2033 and my flight and I suppose. Oh, and if the heretics come for our lives, we will stand for so you got me, you damned heretics. This looks like Fallout. Metro focuses more on characters and oh. Ah, they didn't show the release date. February 22nd, 2019. Oh. You've got a release date. How many games it's are coming out this year? Fallout with better characters, basically. It's Metroid Exodus. <laughs> Metro had me at its gritty visuals, it's tiny. Its brutal landscapes, and its mystery of the ruins above ground. What I love about our art form is the vast range of creative expression, the ruins from above grim post-apocalyptic battles like to hand-painted spirit guardians. Now, the first two whatever world Metro these creators build, on whatever story they and tell, this one they're going whatever sound the effects they, they use, the we will work with creators to guarantee that their games look Fallout. and play uh, best uh, on Xbox split? One. Not Fallout. Shut up. <laughs> like this next game. Maybe you yeah, played in that show again. I'll do an I'll do an alpha rad video. Fan. Look. I get Our it. You're sick of Fallout, so I found not Fallout. <laughs> For the first time ever on Xbox, Kingdom Hearts. Oh! Well, well, well. <laughs> it's cold! Guess he's too used to the beach. Hey, Islander, oh, what so can I say? Annoying as ever. Oh, God damn, Sora, has Look, your voice got even the fucked. Seas turning to ice. Wow. Oh, it's, uh, where is it frozen? Yeah. I mean, that one we already knew was going to be in there. Let it go. A walking, talking go. snowman. You really go. are alive. Hello. Here we go, Spyro. Olaf, are these your friends? Oh, so oh no. no. Never met him. Don't know anyone blue, green, or No, not the snowman. Oh, we got wings now. Oh, a freeze oh. blade from Skylanders. Oh. Give me strength. Kingdom Hearts is oh. a new SSX. Oh, we've got snowboarding. Don't forget to ride Big Splash River Rapids. Richard Ralph. Yeah. Mini game. Oh, Tangle. Yo yo. Mini game. Yo yo. Oh, the ship's back. No. All oh, the gummy ships are back. At least the gummy ship Look looks alright. Hey, the deer heart looks, looks pretty cool. Whoa. That's amazing. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. You can control ice. 
Control it? No, all I ever do is hurt people. That's amazing. This you can control now, ice. It's not like I've controlled oh, no. ice and cast the ice spells anymore. in the previous so games. Hark! <laughs> <laughs> Is it, it's like Caesar from Jojo. <laughs> what I don't get is why they change Sakura drops to don't think twice because it just looks, it just sounds so much worse than Sakura drops. Yeah. Roxas does exist. Why did they His heart's face? inside my heart. Oh, the other Twilight Town is oh, just no, data. Roxas. So what will Elsa yeah. accept? Light oh. or darkness? Oh, hi, I know. I want to know. Oh. Well, good for you. But guess oh, Lar what? Larcy. I won't let her fall. Larcy, oh, you're dead. dead. Oh, it's there. He was. It's Tommy Wiseau, the Thirteenth Seeker of Darkness. I mean, it's not exactly, but yeah. Yes, Is that? Uh, yeah. Mickey. Wait, is that, wait, is that a dark aqua? Oh, oh fuck. Is it's a dark aqua. No, it's a Xenor aqua. aqua. Exclusive. Oh. Exclusive. Oh yeah, I have seen that giant shark that people have uh, talked about, but it's still not that good. <laughs> Maybe I'll renew my game pass if they add any good stuff. You needn't cower in the doorway. Oh, are we actually getting actually some actual like story for this game now? People. Besides, the conversation with my friend here has reached a bit of an impasse. I think you just need a moment to cool it's a shame off. I already got my refund for this game. Now, I sense that you brought me something to inspect. Show me. Oh. The waves of change roll throughout oh the seas, God. and a new land is revealed. The forsaken shores. A place of darkness, where fire and ash consume all. And from the depths, skeleton crews will rise to curse the seas. More door, by the way. An ancient evil set loose upon the Sea of Thieves. You have delivered unto me a portent terrible. Why are people putting sleeping emotes in the chat? Oh! <laughs> you just wanted to know how much it was worth, didn't you? Fine, I'll give you ten for it. He's basically the complexo. Forsaken Shores isn't even out till September, and Cursed Sales is in July. <laughs> so, well, wow. Lisa making something for it. So what are what is it? Just freaking expansions? Well, she said a new land, so I'm going to assume a new map. You know, I can't really read that because you flashed it up too f Oh. 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 Well, I mean, I'll type it down, but I can easily this skip this, this one. Because I've already covered Battlefield. Buckets of us doing it. Yeah. That meets and barn that I did my story on. Scarpening a monster. Did, did, did you add Kingdom Hearts 3 to, to the list? Yeah. Be bit. At noon, at eight. But the tell my went there. Oh yeah, skiing. I remember today. You get to ski. And a woman who need no man. Exclusive <laughs> world Thanks. premiere. Oh, we got both. We got oh, both um, sound bites then. Forza. Forza 4. Where's the car? Forza Horizon 4. 
It's set in England, China, and Japan. Forza. What was probably I know how you feel about these freaking uh, racing. Or like Forza! I, I have a friend that is obsessed with Forza and I've heard all about the leaks in that. But has he confirmed or not whether Phil Spencer's got a new car? Force of Brexit! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Someone's put that. Nice. Racing to get the immigrants out of the country. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, beautiful. Of course you get the little 1960s caps. You know, my favorite part about this concert so far is freaking Kingdom Hearts 3 and Mori 2. No, this is already better than EA. Yeah. I mean, they, they never explain anything about any game whatsoever, so... Like, explanations get, get... So explanations get thrown right in the, in the fucking ditch, but... And a lot of it's but just pre-rendered cutscenes, so we don't even hardly get to see any gameplay, so gameplay goes in the bin, but... At least it's better than EA's uh, Investor Conference. Yeah, Please tell me we get to drive you those other factors. You get the dog box! Do we actually? Good fun, good fun. Do we actually get to drive the dog boat? We get to drive the dog boat. Please welcome from Playground Games, Ralph Fulton. I don't see where the car could potentially come from though, because there's a lot of computer screens on stage. I don't think we're going to have a new car this year. Thank you. No, we're getting so a new much. car. It is fantastic That's to one. be here today. I am excited to show you the world premiere of Forza Horizon 4, set in beautiful, in historic Britain. It's also half past midnight. Forza Horizon Brexit 4 means features Brexit. dynamic seasons in a shared open world, and seasons life. change it's everything. It's just people spamming Brexit. Let me introduce you to some of our team who will be helping demo the game today. Please welcome Bill, who is online with a few friends in the beautiful English countryside. He has chosen the incredible new McLaren Senna. England and beautiful do I'd not go to together. Solemn, who is hanging out with his buddies on the streets of Scotland's capital, Edinburgh. So Solomon is driving oh, the flicker, Hunnigan love Ford it. Focus. They've got the special control. And please welcome Andy, whose off-road buggy is perfect for taking jumps, scaling rocky terrain, and having fun on the coastline of Britain. But first, Why? let's join Rebecca. She is enjoying the summer in her highly customized Nissan Silvia. In Pittsburgh. The sun is out, the sky is blue, and it's the perfect... Where's Birmingham? I want to get drive. stabbed in Forza. Hold on a minute, the sun is out and the sky is blue. This is clearly already inaccurate. Yeah, this is not Britain. Yeah. yeah. 90% it's really grey and rainy. Where are you getting this uh, skies of blue sunny weather in England from? Just look at the cars. Let's join Bill. He's in the same shape. Well, well, I just like driving at speeds made even more. I'm gonna buy this for the dots by by the brand new 60 <laughs> FPS mode. <laughs> Meanwhile, Andy is bouncing yeah, around the is. dunes nearby. As you can see, Horizon 4 is still full of action. It does look fun. quite fun for a Forza game. And the now Horizon game is happening actually seasons quite good, so. change everything. In Horizon 4, every like season every changes game. the world. No, but you get a duck bar. Unique beauty and unique yeah. gameplay. You can no, you don't understand like, One of the great things about the shared world is that it's easy to interact with the people you, you meet. Here, Solomon and Rebecca use the new quick chat it's feature on the D-pad yeah. to start a new friendship. Have you ever been in the duck bar? Like Rebecca has found some like-minded friends. 
Remember when the duck boat sat on fire? <laughs> it's great to play solo, but it's better to play with others. No, but Rise at one point the duck boat had to be shut down because it got from it lit on the game it world. sat on fire on the River Thames. Seasons, time of day, and weather conditions are dynamic, but they are synchronized for every player, so the entire community will experience them at the same time. Now, as much as we'd all love to sit and watch the sun go down together, let's see how this scene looks in winter. We still need some games. The entire open world changes beyond recognition. In winter, the lake has frozen solid, and previously inaccessible areas can be reached. Is this Scotland? The trees have entirely lost their leaves, and snow and ice cover the terrain. You the can't drive on a frozen lake. Couldn't be more different. No. And now a blimp has appeared over the ice. So the of the physics of is that? World event. Live, I mean, it depends how cold it is. If it's like Russia, where the lake, the ice on the lake is ridiculous. Like and while they head off to the event, I'd like to show you how the world of Forza Horizon 4 looks in spring. We don't care. Once again, the world of oh, go. That's more with the seasons, bringing new driving experiences, new gameplay, and new events across the whole world. Every season, there are new reasons to play Forza Horizon 4, and the huge, creative, fun-loving Horizon care. community Forza will be Horizon there to enjoy 4 them Animal with you. Crossing Edition. <laughs> Brexit means Brexit Edition. Duck Boat Edition. Today, you've seen a completely new take on Horizon. In Forza Horizon 4, you will live in a vast, beautiful world in which dynamic seasons change everything. Forza Horizon 4 is coming to Xbox One and Windows 10 oh, on October 2nd and I am thrilled to announce that it will be included in Xbox Game Pass Beautiful on the ass. same day. Thank you so much. I might check that out. I might have a new Game Bill Pass Spencer. and check that out. I live in Burnley. It's not pretty. We know that exclusive yes, games from our Microsoft Studios are what originally turned so many of us into Xbox fans. My team and I take our commitment to you seriously to make Xbox we One the best place for you to play into fans. and for you to have the best games on the world's most powerful console. This is why we're increasing our investment in our existing franchises that you already love wow, and so cool. this Gears is why we are amplifying our investment in new worlds why isn't that Bill will Gates deepen here? your love for gaming Minecraft. on xbox we embarked on a quest a quest to find creative teams that have the mastery of our art form and we found so why are any of innovative game designers master storytellers exceptional world builders. And now, I'm yeah. proud to introduce the creation of a brand Legend new Microsoft Legend of Forza, studio. Oracle of Seasons. <laughs> the initiative. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> Led by Daryl Glatt Gallagher, a visionary storyteller who has worked across some of the most iconic franchises for over 20 years. What? This new Santa Monica studio is building a team of world-class talent to create groundbreaking new game experiences. And next, I'm excited I'm to welcome while we chat Undead shit. Labs to Microsoft Studio. This studio uh, caught our attention with their with... visionary approach to building a zombie survival franchise. Oh God. They just released their second infestation oh, into the world. And in the first two weeks, over is. two million of you I don't have joined care the fight about to survive. One. And it looks like the chat doesn't either. Now, it's, it's my distinct it's pleasure to announce that we out. have acquired Playground Games. That thing is trash. This is you already have Playground Games! Of this generation. 
celebrated for their incredible craftsmanship. Not only will Playground Games continue to work on Forza the Horizon, studio, you get it, they make Forza. they're bringing their open world expertise to an entirely new project. We can't wait to share more about that later. Go. I think they mean they acquired it for, and for the fourth new studio. It's my personal honor to welcome Ninja Theory to Microsoft Studio. What? Oh shit. What? That's pretty cool. I met too. Nina and Tamim when we collaborated on Kung Fu Chaos back on the original Xbox. The people that made Hellblade. And a minute into now... playing Hellblade, you know you're in the hands of master storytellers who are fearless about telling bold That's cinematic true. stories. This is a team gifted in creating new franchises. And yes, we've got a fifth studio to announce. Compulsion Games. Two years ago, we premiered a game we couldn't get out of our heads. Oh, it's We Happy Few. A game that be. captivated us with its Oh, strong, We Happy Few, the game that got bastardized time. by Randy Pitchford. We Happy Few is, release, is, is nearing its full release to gamers everywhere. So please help me in welcoming Wait. all oh, of our shoot. new studios. Microsoft have dead or alive. By joining us at Microsoft Studios, these five new teams will have the resources, the platform, and creative independence to make big, take bigger risks, create even bolder worlds for you. Well, the guys at Compulsion won't because they sided with Randy fucking Pitchford. Isn't that the decision we all made? Oh. But you know the truth. No, I think don't they've you? taken. So wait. No, Gearbox. No There's not a thing I can tell you oh, that no. you don't already know. Is there? Have you had your joy, Ollie? People in town are getting a tad bit skinny. I think they're starving to death. And they're painting the streets in like rainbows. You Have you not noticed? Oh, Ollie. Why are you all wearing those ridiculous new masks? You should get one. They shape your face into a smile, and when you smile, you can't help being happy. We have to tell people. They need to know the truth. No! It's better not to know. <laughs> wiki, wiki, everybody. And it's another... I know what we have to do. <laughs> yeah, I fucking backed it, and then Randy Pitchford fucked it. Arthur, we're practically the only two people in this entire well, no, city who have spilled out of our minds on joy. It's not a lovely day for it. It's a f***ing terrible day for it. If you force people to have the emotions you want, then you've turned them into robots made out of meat. Where is it? Where's the Blackberry? You've gone too far this time. People Still won't face spider. that. I mean, I wouldn't play it. I Not until we okay. take their joy. And when we do that, you get me. they'll murder each other in the street. That's the day before my birthday. Mm -hmm. Yay! Exclusive. It's our oh, conscience. There we go, console. Oh, Jesus Christ. PUBG! It's already you... out! PUBG's already out! They're, they're bringing the, the actual optimized version now, not the shit version. Yeah, the optimized version. They're, they're bringing the PC version to Xbox, yeah. Mirror Mars already out. Been out for like four months. Yeah, I told you, it's just the optimized version. It's just the PC version of the game. That's new. No, this is just some pre rendered shit. Don't expect to see this in the game. No, no that's gameplay, it's the map. Isn't it? No, this is not gameplay. Yeah, no, that, that is. Oh shit, there was the frying pan, boys! You better not Time put one of them in your games or we're gonna sue your ass! 
Or is it just 50 v 50? I don't think anybody cares. They already tried I to mean, sue. I mean, I sort of do, but I don't care about the Xbox version. <laughs> no, but they already tried to sue Fortnite and they fucked themselves. This is like their attempt to try and re-grab the spotlight. Winter? Yeah. This beat is out. What's this game? Play Unknown's yeah. Battlegrounds. Fuck you. Yeah. Game is unfinished. It's, it's, it's got a full release. World premiere. Sky four, sky four, sky four, sky four, sky four. Tail. Oh shit! What's this? That is a, it's Tails Chesteria. What? Really? Tails Chesteria has been remastered. What? Oh shit! Oh shit! Now this is the best one in the series. It's really good. Oh my god, I love the Dale games. Oh, this is cool. And you'll like, you'll be able to play it on another console. It's not an exclusive, so PS4 favorite part It's not just 360 exclusive. This is best. This is no, this is best area. The best one. Oh. Wait, hold on. Aren't Tails games also on Nintendo? No, World but best area was an Xbox 360 exclusive. Sky yeah. Four, Sky Four, Sky Four, Sky Four. It always Sky says Washington in these little DC, boxes. The most heavily protected city on Earth. What is this shit? Within its limits, this is 177 Skyfall. foreign embassies, 550 elected officials, and 23,000 military personnel. In the event of an Where's attack, Skyfall? critical personnel are evacuated. Underground shelters open, while complex defense systems patrol the sky. But nothing stopped the virus. 27 days after patient zero. Washington fell. Oh god, it it's began some sort of shit with riots on game. K Street, then shootings. Oh, in this one more scene. Troops withdrew to bunkers. Civilians were left in the streets. America is on the brink of collapse. But some people have survived. Gardens grow on rooftops. Their fences patrolled with rifles. In communities that live under constant siege. Survival has taken the form of urban warfare. Centuries ago. On this Glass. very soil, brother it's fought heavy. brother, spilling blood to forge the United States. History is threatening to repeat itself. Now, in the heat of summer, six months after the urban outbreak warfare. began, no, it's not called the urban warfare. That's just that splash shit. Ready to engage At least it's not a zombie war. It is a zombie game. Didn't you hear us say some patient zero? Standing against it. No, but it's how do you save a nation when its other. enemies come from within? No, it's the zombie game. They said patient zero. Or... Oh, Division 2! That's what it is! The enemies come from within? Powered by Snowdrop, the blind pony. <laughs> Ubisoft. <laughs> We only have 10 minutes left. You don't know that. Matt, that crash site is well, I've got to leave it. 50 games. Duke, Kit, did you guys hear oh, that? I don't yeah. write the time. last 10 minutes I have on flipping. <laughs> they're doing the it's mic. It's not a zombie game. By the way, I'm just pointing out they're doing the mic trick. Look at this parachute. Dropped right through the ceiling. 
Let me see if I can get this. Megan, shut the fuck up. You don't talk like that on a normal oh, voice chat. <laughs> you like... So you guys are coming or what? Oh my god, fucking yeah. mic tricking me. I hate I hate the Merry mic trick. Christmas. It just... What is the mic trick? Right, so it's you hear all these people talking, talking, like saying are you no, checking out this parachute swoop. That's people on a microphone talking to each other as if we are talking now. Those voices okay, will not be in guy. the game. Mm -hmm. When in reality this is not how you would talk to each other, you'd be like Oh, dickhead, okay, you, you, see, you seen this parachute knob shite? Okay, meet us at the sinkhole? <laughs> yep. Okay, sure. I'm just gonna check Twitter. Wow. The, the mic, okay. I'm just gonna actually gonna tweet capital. it because I actually don't care. The mic tricks just put me off even caring You should have a new side shit. mission on the map. Yeah, we're not that far. Okay, do it after the crash site? Sounds good. Watch, it's not gonna look like this. Hey, I see you. I'll be up in a sec. Kit, we gotta get you leveled up. I know, please help. I've been busy. Toxic chemical residue detected. Oh, wow. A lot of loot down there. Hey, you guys should really check this out. Almost there. So that's the control point. He's still fucking doing it as well. Hey, wait for me. Crap, they have a tank. Yep, I see him. Don't aggro him yet. Let me adjust my build. Got my crossbow and chem launcher. Oh, just for fuck's sake, shut the fuck up. Chem cloud out. Matt, can you flank them and get a clear shot? I'll take that sniper on top. The downgrade, it's not even that again. People don't talk like this to be like, oh, fucking shoot that dickhead. Yeah, boy, fucking shoot him. Oh. Oh, that was so forced there. Grenade, grenade. Yeah, it is false. That's what I say. None of this audio will be in the fucking game, and it's just like cringy and makes me not interested in this fucking game. Grenade, grenade. Whoa, that's a lot of loot. Yeah, that's what I say. Oh, there's a dude rushing through the plane. Uh, Guys. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. Got him. I'm down. Yeah, this hang on, I'll get you. Down. I'll cover you guys. Ooh. Come on, come on. What's my Alex? Why are you cringing? No, I just went oof. Shoot that weak point! Shoot their forehead! Well, no, no, if they shot the forehead, then they wouldn't be able to, to do this fake communication the mic trick, bollocks. Map with the hive, nice. Alright, just lay it on him. Again? Drop down. Lay it yeah, off. There goes his armor. Ah! You're on your own. Keep going! Level up! Level 30! Oh, sweet! Alright, flare is up. Now. Control point is ours. Nice. He's so bad. You guys wanna check out the plane? Let's go. <laughs> no one talks like that. Analyzing no, ballistic not more. No. Looks no, like a fine. rough landing. <laughs> this is what I expected. Cringe, cringe, cringe. They were doing so well after on Microsoft. Whoa, that's nuts. This is what I expected. Let's check it out. Great idea, let's just die. So, game plan. Please do. Take the capital back. I think we're ready. Three, two, one, go, 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 go.
I don't care. I don't bring some support. That was either. just so cool. Please uh, welcome the head of engineering, Xbox Game Pass, Ashley Spiker. You mind it? Well, I ain't gonna be able to see any more announcements, then. Why? Just... It's only... Just fucking stay up. This is a special time really for not. gamers. We've never had so many no, incredible games sounds. to play. Mm -hmm. Storied franchises, uncharted be a worlds, pussy. new releases, this and cult classics. Genres we love, forward. and genres we'd love to explore. There's only one problem. Too often we are forced to choose one match. amazing game over another. So we set out to solve that problem. Uh, and to yeah, answer the question, over. what if you didn't have to choose? What if you it's could play them all? The answer, Xbox Game Pass. A way to give gamers the ultimate freedom no. to play. <laughs> And your response has blown us away. One low monthly payment. Not only are you payment. playing more games, you are spending more time gaming. Freedom of choice is leading to more discovery, more play, and more fun. And we couldn't be more inspired to keep building and unlocking Enjoy more things. for you. So for the last year, we've been working on how to give you faster access to all those games. We leveraged the machine learning expertise we have at Microsoft and invented a way to start sure your games twice as fast. And naturally, we're calling it fast Even startup. Even Evil says Unlike on, the um, ready to start on his system, Twitter, which is manually configured, this is not gamer communication. Oh my god, needs more take my rocket launcher, pussy. ...actually play games. And Fast Start is designed to get better as the algorithms and parameters are refined over time. I'm pleased to Whoa, announce that this? Fast Start will launch for select titles in the June update coming later this month. Dude, Zoinks, ga Zoinks with Games has just tweeted something about Ghost Giant and it looks like Animal Crossing. Ultimately, it all comes down to the games. We'll continue to deliver yeah, thanks, iconic favorites thanks, like Halo the Master Chief Collection mm -hmm. coming what? later this oh. year. I'm just gonna Google. And we also um, plan to release all new exclusive games from Microsoft Studios, including Forza Horizon 4, Crackdown 3, and more, into the Xbox Game Pass catalog. Oh, it's on for the PSVR. That's a shame. Release. I would actually have liked to have seen what Every else they were gonna put out. We'll also bring new games from leading creative studios into your Xbox Game oh. Pass library. Games like Ashen, okay. Warhammer Vermintide 2, After Party, okay. and Phoenix Point, okay. all available in Xbox, Xbox Game Pass the same day as the global it? release. So that's what's next, but let's talk about what's happening today. Yay! More A. Tom Clancy's The Division. <laughs> I like how next to no one's clapping, like they're just the, saying get on The with Elder it. Scrolls yeah. Online yeah. Tamriel Unlimited. Yay. And Fallout 4. Why is somebody screaming feminism in the chat? Very minor claps. All enhanced for Xbox One X in gorgeous 4K. <laughs> And all of them playable today in Xbox Game Pass. Is it bad that I just keep checking Twitter? Thank you to all of the developers working with us to bring freedom of choice to like, gamers around the world. Before I was tweeting Xbox Game Pass. just for initial reactions and they were leading strong in this second half is just like so shit. <laughs> You were doing so well, Microsoft, and now you're just going into EA. Oh, the Golf Club 2019. Gotta get that golf.
Oh, Super Mini Boy forever. Oh, Battle Royale! There's another Battle Royale! We're up to eight! We're up to fucking eight this year, Jesus. Ah! Why are we up to eight fucking Battle Royales? Fuck. Ooh, Dead Cells is coming to the Xbox. That's not bad. New game coming to Why he looks nice. Square Enix. I thought I knew why I came here. Why did you come here, Squibble Bits? I saw it. The end. But now the truth feels further away than ever. Tomb I still Raider? Have so many questions. You said you were going out. But I heard you through the I said don't go for it looks Tomb Raider. You had me so We can't let Trinity get hold of this. Let's think this through. Realize the tragedy you have unleashed. The cleansing has begun. It falls to me now to stop it before it consumes us all. What have I done? To believe. You don't know that you caused all this, Laura. Yep, Tomb Raider. You need to trust me. Did Alex just die? You have to trust each other. No, he's still here. No, I'm here. I'm not seeing any gameplay, I'm just seeing a load of pre-rendered cutscenes again. If you had that power, what would you do? Exclusive. Could actually be skate. I see you got the skateboards. They say I'm like Bruce Willis, unbreakable, die hard. You might actually have got your wish, Alex. Is it skate though? Are, are you confirming this, or is it like something else? No sessions. Oh, it's the spiritual success of this game. Okay. I've played sessions of this and I've played the demo. 
Well, new scary game, at least. It's a spiritual su successor. Exclusive. Game. I guess you could, like, cross off Alan your bingo cards on Skate 4, but... I beg to differ. I'll give it a I was born three times, and I've met death three times. My first home was Altanova. The curiosity I gained there cost me my first life. Looks like some sort of world of I awoke Warcraft again in Tarif, village of the sorcerers. You guys are looking at you. I once thought that this would be my true home. Everything changed when I started to ask the forbidden Which questions. Ones, you know? What exactly is the true nature of the Black Stone? Oh, it's, hold on. This, well, hold on. This what looks like Black the Desert, Desert Oh, it is. It's Black Desert. Who was okay, it that was calling me from the depths uh, beyond the desert? What is Black Desert? Because they're not going to show gameplay, so what actually is Black no, Desert? No, the game's already out. It's been out for four years. They just fought on, blinded. And hungered for more and more. Yeah, of the and, it's, and the gameplay is really boring. Not but is this actually the hidden secrets once and all like that? Yeah, but again, they're not going to show any real gameplay. So what actually is like that? That is the gameplay. What you see now is the gameplay. Yeah. Why would you need to show gameplay anyway? The game's out already. If you dare to learn your true wretched self. Behold, I am Elezra, the darkness born from the desert. I, I know it's Black Desert, I know that sound effect that... Ah! This I is basically... Ready to it's already out! This is basically the game. World the premiere. All content shown, rendered in engine in real time. We've known each other like a long time. What the fuck is this? It's a nigga. What the you hell is this? Much, You've got me intrigued. You Devil May Cry 5? Capcom? Possibly. DMC 5? Yeah, that's Dante. Oh. 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 It's New Dante. There's nothing that wrong with New Dante. Yeah, I just don't... I prefer old Dante, but if it keeps the same gameplay, it's the answer. And it looks like he's growing older and he's got the white hair, so they're gonna try and make him more like original Dante. Skin and abort mission is new Dante. Yeah, he's a real pro at smacking demons around. That's why I built him that well functioning arm <laughs> to kick demon ass. Alright, here we go. Oh, the DMC? Yeah, shit. We're gonna carry on. What? Gonna no chit-chat or monologue? Just getting right to the point, huh? Oh, because no one cares about New Dante. Like, his hair is literally just the most favorite guy's hair white. Like, you know his new Dante was like original Dante as a child. Oh, they agreed that it was an alternate universe. My brilliant badass work is worth every dime. You know it. <laughs> Cash first. Kenny, get back inside now! I've got a score to settle with that son of a bitch. I like the music. The designs of the demons look pretty cool. Please welcome, from Capcom, producer Matt Walker, and director Hideaki oh, wait, Itsuna. Hold on. There's actual Dante, alright. Oh, that was his brother Neo. Neo had the short hair. 
As director, I wait four years for this. Thank you so much. DMC is back. English, English is hard. Matt, you do it. Of course. It's been 10 years since Devil May Cry 4 was released, and fans have been asking for a true sequel ever since. So this is our response, loud and clear, that we hear you. Devil May Cry and Hideaki Itsuno are back! Yeah. Early on in the development of Devil May Cry 5, we set our sights on creating something that was going to have world-class okay. visuals. So we've scanned what? 80 costume models for all of our main characters, and with the power of Xbox One X, yeah, we're able to render them as DMC realistically as Devil May Cry, then we're fine. Now, while visuals well, are DMC really important, Devil May Cry was a good game. It, mechanically, so it was great. The best ruined, ruined to ensure that we can it didn't ruin his character because his character was already a wise-cracking asshole. That we've made something that feels better than any oh, action game DMC. we've ever created. I can, I can tell you on. the difference. DMC Devil May Cry versus Devil May Cry. All of the fans 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 of the the fans of the fans of the fans of the fans of the fans the fans of the fans fans and we hope I, you look I forward to seeing more. Have a great E3! <laughs> what crazy little Chinese dudes. Exclusive. They're Japanese! Cuphead? Oh shit, Cuphead 2! Oh shit, Cuphead 2! <laughs> Chef Saltbreaker. Coming 2019. Exclusive. Well, there you go. That's uh, let's type that in. Oh, fine. Oh. I, was, I was gonna love that game. Cuphead 2. Oh my god, it's this game. I have been did tunic. This looks so fucking amazing. I've been really wanting to see a lot more of tunic. Right now? I already know what this game is, it's Tunic. It was shown off last year. Green. It looks so nice. Yeah, I'm... Please talk about that one, Phil Spencer. That tiny fox in a big world is a prime example of the reach of gaming today. A labor of love conceived and created by a single developer in Halifax, Nova Scotia, is today commanding gaming's largest stage. Whether you're sharing the adventure of a tiny fox with more than 20 million viewers on Mixer or teaming up with Xbox Live friends to slay zombies, gaming is an incredible community. We've always believed that building community is vital for gaming. There's real power in our shared experience. Sharing the same world, the same seasons, the same campaigns. 
and there's real meaning in sharing our love of gaming with fellow gamers. This community is the reason why we love premiering games here at E3. For the rest of our briefing, everything you show you will be world premiere games no one has seen before. Oh shit. Starting off with something entirely new from our friends at Bandai Namco. On my last trip to Japan, their creative team showed me a sneak peek at their next game. Now, you get to see the first look. World premiere. Namco. There are worlds that exist separate from our own. Where the impossible is reality. They consist of both good. I've seen that. I've seen that evil. bear head, lion head before. These worlds were never meant to meet. But I can't remember where. But things have changed. Catch up. Oh no! Wow. It's the it's that Project Vein I think. Naruto, what? And our last hope. Oh no, it's uh Uniting Capcom Goku! Goku for Smash! Oh, I see Frieza! What the f It's J Star, you you dropped them as J Star's victory versus. What would rip what would win? Rasengan Shuriken or Kamehameha? Goku has fucking Jump Force. Jump Force. Alright then. I was right, oh. oh, it's that fucking dude from Death Note. Unite to fight. <laughs> World premiere. There is nothing permanent except change. It's been 15 years since the fall. The city is a state is a of decay. Corpse, and we are the worms. We burrow in it. Fighting for every useful piece of land. To preserve ourselves from the terrors of the night and the horrors of the day. I hear zombies screaming. Who can hear my voice? I shall therefore speak a word unto hear. Anyone who dares to steal food will be hanged, and their bodies will be exposed. Yeah, Every day we rise from dust to choose between bad and worse. Dying light. Oh These choices we take to survive will create the world to come. Your choices. Oh God, your world. You know the drill. Get to the nearest safe house and wait until dawn. Good night. And good luck. Dying light. Too. Told you. Please welcome narrative yeah. designer Chris Avalo. Uh, to invite people, yeah, invite people. Hi, I'm Chris Avalon, and I'm excited to be working with Techland to create the world of Dying Light 2. Dying Light 2 is everything you'd expect from a bold sequel of the first game. A fluid parkour system with improved natural movement, deep and tactical first-person melee combat, 
And of course, terrifying nights when the infected are made from the depths of the city to feed uh, on the, anyone the, they the can find. At the same time, we invite you to too. a new vision of the post-apocalypse, a bleak and uh, unforgiving reality that we call the modern dark ages. Today, right however, we want to give you a look at one of the impressive new features of Dying Light 2, a technical and narrative advancement for the franchise. Dying Light 2 will be the first in its genre where your choices have genuine consequences in the game itself. From how it looks, yeah, but they won't plays, though, because every the person occur, under the sun has said that and the never do. Change based on your decisions. Everybody in the, the following demo do is what? a bit do, more light on that spiral, do what? All your choices, like, matter. Every single choice you have matters in the end, and it's like, no, it doesn't. Many games have said, oh, every single thing matters. Every single choice you make will will affect the ending. I mean, even most recently, Detroit Become Human. It's like, so many choices, so many pathways, and it'll affect the ending. So it's like, no, it won't. There's only two endings. There's either a good one where you do everything right, Dying or a bad one where you fuck up. Dying Light 2 features a functioning up. ecosystem that reacts on multiple levels to the things you do and the choices you make. In the example we are about to show you, our protagonist undertakes a mission for the Peacekeepers, one of the many factions active in the city. They want you to negotiate with two survivors who are controlling and hoarding a water supply. Are you going to solve this with another final offer? Let's say you choose to carry out the Peacekeeper's orders, one way or another. After this, you will start seeing a significant change in the city, as access to the water supply allowed the Peacekeepers to bring stability and develop the area. Just like Detroit become human! There's even running water for the people at street level, and that raises their morale and allows you to replenish your energy on the go. But there's a cost to this. The PKs have a rigid approach to law and order. So while the streets may be safer, it's only safer for those who side with them. So if you get on their bad side. Now let's return to that moment of choice. And instead of killing them, you choose to team up with this group right, to supply yo, Alex, water uh, on the black market. Friend Luke's gonna be joining As you the, will uh, see, this creates a very different set of consequences it, for the city. The, okay, water who being created a the Zhuang Gang It brings you access lad. to new resources and trade, but this Not in turn me. attracts the worst type of people to the area. And this is just a single decision, one out of hundreds you will have to make. But it allows you to carve out your own world. Each player's yeah, game experience won't, will be unique. It won't be By unique. The way, Stop pulling this, is this just what shit. Happens in the day. At night, well, things tend to get a lot darker. Oh yeah, and it goes down. Exclusive. World premiere. Well, I guess I won't be I won't be ranting about that. A lot of time has passed. Oh. You've gotten soft, complacent. You always knew this day would come. You always knew the three of you would be needed again. You always wait. What? Battle Wait, yeah, that was What? The memes are live. A brand new game featuring body morphing genre mashups, three player couch co op, 4K hand drawn 2.5D graphics, and broad non specific feature declarations. They're back. Well, Looks like Bubs is gonna have a friend. Guys, tell me, are you messing with me? World premiere. Nope, it was just on. Remember, you know, I, I was born to fight wars that no army could win. There was no fear, no failure. Just cause forward. But the rules have changed. Yes. The enemy. Changed. Who is this? And no 
just one cause for. was ready for it. Avalanche Studios. The Black Hand. They are the world's most powerful private army. The Black Hat? But even they should feel... Greetings, vile villains! It is me, Black Hat, here. This is survival. This looks like pretty generic. Does that happen a lot? Want me getting shot at? Only time. Just, just chucking these at me, aren't they? Ah, oh, that's raised the roof. Gears of War 7. What? What? Why are the Funko Pops? Please welcome studio head Rod Ferguson. Thirteen years ago, when I began my Gears of War journey, we had no idea how big this franchise would become. And as it's grown, We've dreamed of taking it to new places and different ways to reach even more fans. And that's why today we're announcing Gears Pop, a collaboration with our friends at Funko to bring a unique mobile spin oh, to the world of Gears. Oh, it's a mobile game. And mobile is not the only new place we're going. I'm excited to also announce the true Gears of War PC experience in a completely different genre, Gears Tactics. You create a whole new squad, 12 years before Gears of War 1, as they hunt a locust monster maker responsible for destroying whole cities. It's our take on the classic turn-based strategy genre, with a character-driven story, faster, more aggressive gameplay, a customizable squad and equipment, and of course, it wouldn't be a Gears game without a massive boss battle. We look forward to sharing more about tactics with you soon. But it's not just about going to new places. It's also about having new experiences. And the amazing team at the Coalition is working hard to bring you our most ambitious Gears of War title yet, Gears 5. Fucking hell. How many do we want to make? As Kate, as Kate, you'll journey across the biggest and most beautiful world we've ever created with the war for humanity escalates on two fronts, outside the capital city and within Kate herself. In this moment from the game, Kate leads a rescue message to a remote village, but something leave? goes horribly wrong. No. Tile all left. Good. Does he keep really being <laughs> Oh, we get to now play as the strong female protagonist that don't need no man. Kate. Kate. No, 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 Kate, Kate, you can't see this. You don't want to see this. Oh, 
F to pay respects. Okay. Everybody in the chat's just spamming F to pay respects. Sorry. Thanks for coming here. Of course. Can I recommend we maybe get these people out of here? Hey, just slow down. No, Foz is right. We need to move. What are you talking? He's dead, man. Give her a minute. She'll get her minute in the Raven. What the hell is wrong with you? Del, we need to leave. I'm not going. Excuse me? For months now, I've been having these dreams. Nightmares. But I think they were messages. What? Something's, something's happening to me. Your grandmothers? Enough. We'll, we'll deal with this later. Foss, round these people up. I need help. There's a place up north. I think we can find you answers there. No! No! <clears throat> Absolutely not. We have orders. You'll go with me. God damn it, both of you, listen. I'll go with her. Look, if you're missing, Jen will notice. Okay? I'll push Jack the coordinates. No, Corporal. You are coming back to Nuafira. That is a direct order. That was my Look, Captain. Me. Screw your order. This isn't about you. It's about me. I need to fix this. There you go. She is hey, a strong watcher. female protagonist that don't need no man. A necklace? That's a Lucas symbol. Yes, yeah, so? She would never be our enemy by choice. I know yeah, that. Because she would die for us. I know that. But what if it's not her choice? It is the choice of the writers showing that she is a strong, independent woman that does not need no man. Even though we did. Where are we going? Back to where it all began. Who's in the shadows? Who's ready? Shady, tell you. This is a wild game of survival. In the entire history of Xbox, in the entire history of E3. In the entire history of our industry, gaming is now at its most vibrant. Today, we shared our commitment to giving you the freedom to discover and play all of the great new games coming to Xbox Game Pass. Today, we showcased more games than we ever have before. 50 games, 18 titles with exclusivity, and 15 world premieres. Today, we shared our most diverse gaming portfolio Two. in every measure, from breadth and art style, genre and cultures, range and subject and setting, scale and story and scope and creative vision. And every one of these plays best on Xbox. <laughs> the world of gaming is on an historic growth path where the increasing number of gamers 
is met with the increasing creative power of game developers. In this I just know it's on the side. My Twitter is now lighting up because of Gears 5. Where can we take gaming next? Our answer? We commit Everybody and harness the full you. breadth of our resources at Microsoft to deliver on the future of play. Our experts in Microsoft Research are developing the future of gaming AI. So the worlds and characters we enjoy will be even more rich and more immersive. Our cloud engineers are building a game streaming network to unlock console quality gaming on any device. Not only that, we are dedicated to perfecting your experience everywhere you want to play, on your Xbox, your PC, or your phone. And of course, our hardware team. The same team that delivered unprecedented performance with Xbox One X is deep into architecting the next Xbox consoles where we will once again deliver on our commitment to set the benchmark for console gaming. And let's oh, talk Jesus, about our games so themselves. We are committed to building an industry-leading first-party studios organization. And as you saw earlier, we are making one of our greatest single-year investments in teams by adding five new creative studios. We have committed our team, our company, our technical resources, so we can declare to you today, and next year, and all of the years after that, you will always experience the best in gaming on Xbox. Yeah, everybody so is just like going to play. crazy about Gears There are worlds War. to be saved, heroes to be made, and legends to become together. Thanks, and have a great eat. Oh, they fucking watchdogs. What dog? Possibly. What is your secret reveal? CD, CD Project Red. It's cyberpunk. Backdoor entry. CPU time. E3 trailer. It's cyberpunk. Red. It is CD Projekt Red. World premiere. Night City. In 2077, they voted my city the worst place to live in America. Main issues, sky high rate of violence, and more people living below the poverty line than anywhere else. What is this? CD Project Red. Can't deny it, it's all true. Net. But everybody still wants to live here. This city's always got a promise for you. Might be a lie, an illusion. But it's there, just around the corner. And it keeps you going. It's a city of dreams. And I'm a big dreamer.
us. It's the outro now. Are we done? We done. I'm gonna go now. See. Well, I'm gonna. I'd stay. Stick around to make sure it's the full outro and they don't pull another CG project red with a secret game. But I think we are pretty much done here. Price to start to show you can parts on an Xbox console. Can't wait for the Nintendo win. Nintendo's last though, that's the thing. Nintendo always does theirs like a day after everybody else. Saying they have everything. So they're waiting till last. Yep, that's it. That is, uh, that's the end. Right, well, that was the, uh... That was good. Mm. Anyway, see you. you, it's okay. It was a lot better than, uh... Bye, Alex. It was a lot better than, um... EA's. So... Yeah, it's all skipped. I mean, I wish they would have shown off some more gameplay, but there was a lot of shit to go through. But that is the end of it. So thank you all for watching this uh, E3 E3 reaction stream thing with me and my buddies. I'm gonna go get ready for. I'm gonna have this one uploaded, as you can probably tell if you're watching it. And I'm gonna go get ready for the Bethesda conference later on tonight, where a lot of people will be asleep so we'll be having a lot of different people like Ferb and Frostheart joining us so I'll see all of you uh, then so thank you for watching and of course if you did like it leave a like if you don't want to miss out on Bethesda and all the other conferences as well as the in-depth looks on all the games like the E3 videos then do hit the subscribe button and bing the bell so the notifications go through and there are links down below if you want to see what I'm tweeting in lifetime, as you might have seen me doing several times throughout the conference. Um, and then there's a link down to the Discord if you want to come in and contribute with everybody, as Alex and Hod and Tyler and everybody else has been doing. And, of course, there is a link to my Patreon if you'd like to support me further. But for now, thank you for watching. And I'll see all of you in a couple of hours with the Bethesda conference.